Greetings, YouTube. I know we are at a crossroads right now as a community. I have heard, just as you probably have heard, from several people that have either officially quit the game or are tempted to quit the game. And I truly believe, as naive as some people think I am for believing this, that Kabam is horrified and panicked that after throwing everything, including the kitchen sink, at their game to try to fix it, despite multiple compensation packages and everything else, we have a huge issue right now that the game simply is broken and it's easy to get discouraged. It's easy to talk about the lag, it's easy to talk about parry and deck still being broken, or the most annoying thing that affects my account more than anything else, the game crashes that have cost me so much health, especially in Alliance Quest, that have lost me uh, precious arena fights that almost lost me my infinite streak. The list goes on and on. But it's not all bad. And on this channel, even though the positive videos seem to never get close to the views that the critical ones do, because human beings, despite our inherent belief that we're good, like to complain and like to be outraged. Believe it or not, there have been studies done that the dopamine level that releases in your brain from feeling entitled and outraged and superior is the same amount of dopamine that you could get for landing a god tier champion at crystal. Kind of crazy to think about, but you can be as addicted to being offended and outraged as you are opening crystals or other dopamine habits of behavior. But I have not come to bury Kabam today, but to praise them for something that I hope we get to see more of in the contest. Now, I'm not talking about Cavalier for this, or Uncollected, or Master, or even Heroic. No. What I'm talking about is a crystal that maybe it's been here for a little while, but it's new to me. The normal, really beginner crystal that you get just for completing normal difficulty, not even exploring it, is this new crystal the questing hero crystal it is basically a premium hero crystal with a twist as you can see it guarantees a two to four star champion and gold so all good things battle chips or units and level two or three health potions level one revive energy refill small energy refills tier two Class Catalyst Crystal or Tier 4 Basic ISO. Now, it's kind of cool if you run through normal, if nothing else, for maybe um, some Marvel Insider points. It's kind of cool to open it if you've got a nice roster, if you're at least uncollected, if not Cavalier or Thronebreaker. But it's not going to make or break your roster. However, if you're level 12 and you pull a combination of like a 4-star Apocalypse and gold, or units, or battle chips, or a, or a revive, or an energy refill. You know, it's a small energy refill too. I guess you can get both the energy refill and the small energy refill in this. I just, I love that concept. Whoever thought of this at Kabam, they deserve a raise. Because this kind of crystal is a pro player move that's going to help out players who are probably overwhelmed by all of the content, not to mention, yes, the game not always working as uh, intended. I, I say this all the time. I was intimidated when I started Marvel Contest of Champions five plus years ago. I almost quit, and there wasn't much to even be overwhelmed about. Now, if you downloaded the game for the first time, and you had to figure out what Alliance Quest and Alliance War, and the side quests, and variant quests, and incursions, and event quests, like, I would just feel as overwhelmed. It'd be like, I used to go to a math class, and I used to, on the first day of school, see our first lesson. This is when there was something called the Saxon textbook. I think they're gone now. And I'd go to the very end of the textbook and look at like less than 110. And it would be like I was looking at Chinese instead of English. Like it was just a completely foreign language. But obviously, by the time you get there, you've hopefully learned the math lessons that prepare you for lesson 105. Well, in the same way, these kind of crystals can help better prepare you to rank up champions and uh, hopefully not be intimidated away from the game. So, Kabam, put more of these in there. Put more questing hero crystals in there. Use these and give us more in, in uh, things like Heroic, you know? That's probably more exciting than an Ultimate Crystal.
which is usually an ultimate disappointment crystal. What up, Wolverine, though? Four-star Wolverine. That's exciting. Uh, so, yeah. It's weird that I'm shouting out normal difficulty, and yet that's what I'm doing in this video. So, yes, pro player move for newer players. Let's keep this video around five minutes and end it here. Thanks for watching.